Welcome to Medicine Woman Tarot. This is going to be a general reading for the sign of Taurus. Please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Father God, in the name of your son, Jesus Christ, tell me to give a clear and accurate reading for the sign of Taurus. If you'd like to make any donations towards my channel, you'll find the link in the description section. Just as a side note, with any donation you give, if you choose to, you could ask me a question in the comment section. And I will make a tarot video for you answering that question. I want to apologize in advance for any background noise you may hear due to the dog snoring. All right, I scurried this purple gem for you today, and the image that showed up for you is very interesting. Um, the image that showed up was a volcano that was erupting, and you could see lots of dark smoke coming out of it. And what's interesting is there was a man climbing up the volcano. He was at the base of it and trying to work his way up towards the top of the volcano, even though it was erupting. So with this coming out, this very much coincides with the cards I flipped out, because you have the snake princess. The Serpentine Path to Power. So we'll get into this in more depth, but in a nutshell, this is like is representing to someone trying to reach the top at all costs and, you know, following a demonic path to reach the top. So that is, a, could be an energy of a coworker or someone within your life that is in that <laughs> negative energy. You know, we also have another way to interpret this card with the Snake Princess here is that you know, this is representing kind of like the Eve energy, you know, like Adam and Eve and Eve eating the apple. So this person I feel is like being represented as a snake. I feel like they sold their soul to get to a position they were at, even though they're climbing up this volcano, it's like representing their path. That's going to lead them to destruction. They keep thinking they're going to reach the top, but all that's going to happen is they're going to get burned in the long run. And I feel like they are finding this out on some level and they are trying to they want to tempt you. They want you to follow down that same path as this energy that I'm picking up because we have this kind of like Eve and the serpent with the apple type energy. Now, the uh, first card to flip out for you today, and like I always say, if the video clicks off during the reading, I will make the second half to it. But the first card to flip out for you is the double card in reverse. So with the double card being here, this is uh, good that it's in reverse. So it's showing all their demonic attacks are going to go back on them. But they are or were coming from a very demonic energy. And I feel like they were trying to send lots of negativity your way, but it is going to be reversed on them. That was clarified by the Knave of Swords. This is the energy of that person. They were spying on you, gossiping about you, obsessed with you because they're coming from a very low vibrational energy. And what's interesting is this person has a snake tattoo on their hand. I don't know if it'll show up. And you also have the snake and the snake princess card. So I feel like they are coming from this very demonic energy. They're upset because they have lost their soul. They are mad because of what they exchanged to try to get worldly things. And, you know, this could be, you know, kind of like the... Uh, I'm picking up like that celebrity type energy. You know, these people that are in the celebrity role, they do terrible, evil acts and they lose their soul for something that's very superficial and fleeting and really has no moralistic value. You know, these actors and, you know, people that are uh, want to be center stage is kind of like the energy that this person's in. But they're spying on you because you have the nine of cups. You're going to achieve all your goals and all the things that make you happy by following the divine path that Jesus is leading you down. You don't need to go down the path of destruction like this person did to achieve materialistic things. God is going to bless you with this without you having to lose your soul. Your soul belongs to Jesus, not demonic energies. And this person um, knows this. So this is why they're coming from that very low vibrational energy. That's why they're trying to like do this uh, demonic temptation. Now, the first card to flip out for you today from the Bible verse is be strong and take heart, all you who hope in the Lord. So just keep on trusting in Jesus and know that he will help you achieve whatever goal it is that you are trying to achieve. And if it's not exactly the goal that you wanted, it's going to be something that's at least um, meant for you to achieve. It's something that is your life purpose and is going to be for your greater good. So that's like the energy I'm picking up here, like I said, with the snake princess card being here. You know, they're trying to uh, tempt you. They're upset. They want you to fall into destruction because they did. And the next card out is Thunderbird Vision Trailblazer. So you're meant to follow a unique path. You know, keep following God. You're not following the trends or the crowds. We'll get into this more in the second half. See you in the next one.